Test, test. One, two. It should be okay. Hopefully, at least. Okay. Hey, everybody. I really trying not to edit this video. Video because, God, my editing software is not cooperating with me. Mainly because, I don't know. I'm 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 having memory problems on my computer. Like even. I can't, uh, basically I can't export videos because my memory keeps crashing on me. I do have, like, 16 gigs of memory, but it's still just flubbing up on me. I think it's just because I had so much stuff going on on my computer. Anyway, today, we're doing something a little bit interesting. We're playing Custom Zombies, um, and we're playing Leviathan. I'm, I'm, I'm certain if you're in the Zombies community, you've seen this map everywhere right now it's a pretty big deal it's like the most ambitious custom zombies map ever um and it feels very treyarch a lot of stuff to do there's a full-fledged easter egg which is what we're going to be doing today on top of doing a bunch of other stuff i've been playing this non-stop for the past couple of days uh which is why i haven't been making dead by daylight stuff on top of you know the memory problems uh this is more of like a game that you stream but i'm whoa okay i'm just I'm just making a video on it because I can't stream. My internet is bad. Every, basically, everything is just terrible in my life right now. And I, I don't even know if I can really stream this because... Uh, or record it, rather, because... It's a pretty laggy map, pretty huge. I lowered the graphics all the way down. I can usually run this game on highest. But uh, I've turned it down to lowest because I don't want to take anything away from performance for you guys so right now we're just going for the time trial right now let's get the wrench it's pretty helpful on this map basically we have to get to round five complete round five rather within five minutes of the game starting so that's basically objective number one for this match it gets pretty tight it's definitely really hard especially since there's no gobble gum anywhere on this map which is pretty cool i i honestly really like how they did that I mean, it is custom zombies, so gobble gums are pretty much OP in these, if there is one. Sometimes there isn't, so... Like in this case, which I actually kind of prefer it this way a little bit. Because, you know, you can just use a shopping fray or... I don't know, disorderly combat to do this pretty easily. Where is the last? Uh, that was pretty rough. We might, not make, we might not make it this time. I might need to restart a couple times, you know. I can't edit this at all. There's literally... I can't make any trims to this whatsoever. I mean, I, I can't do anything that requires me to put it into an editing software. I can even, like, snip a little thing and export it. Because then it will result in me having to export the whole thing. Or exporting it all in any way. My, just, my computer can't handle it right now. I'll probably get that sorted out at some point. I'm going to have to. I might get a new editing software, who knows, but I can't make any adjustments to this. Better not be zombies still in there. Oh my god. There we are. Ooh. Oh, I would have liked to sit on that for a little bit. Okay. That nuke could have been really helpful if I let it last. Basically, we just gotta kill zombies pretty quickly. Round, rounds four and five depend pretty heavily on round ending power ups, basically, insta kills, nukes, staff machines. Those are gonna be pretty huge. So, hopefully, we get some. I'm just gonna try to kill as fast as possible. I'm only really gonna get power ups from these ones and these ones out here. Since you don't drop power ups if they're at a barrier. Didn't know that. Really? Whatever. Uh, what is that? Insta kill, thank god. Beautiful. Okay, now we're gonna shoot the shark. He gives us a power up. Hopefully, it's one of the good ones. Death machine, perfect. This is exactly what we want. Oh, it's okay. It's just this round. This is pretty... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa! 
Perfect. Okay, kind of make sure it's not a free perk because I can screw up the run. I gotta shoot all these sharks. I don't know why sometimes there's a second one there, but it'd be there. I'm actually gonna stay in for this round. Get some use out of this double point. Or, you know, for most of the round at least. Since I'm gonna need a lot of points to open up doors, this can actually help pretty hugely. Oh my god, that's not even gonna do it. Alright, it's gone. Let's get out of here. Grab the wrench. We're gonna hold on to the Mauser. The reason I traded it for the, the Colt at the start is because I think Mustang and Sally's are pretty overrated in Lux's Mr. T Luxifies guide of this map. In his setup tutorial, he recommends the Mustang and Sally. I took, mainly for the boss fight, he like clarifies you use the Mustang and Sally's on the mini boss to get the winner's punch. I went to the boss fight. It took me a whole ammo of it to, to end up uh, killing him. Just think the boom hill does a lot more effective, and it also requires me to get PhD if I take the if I take the cult, obviously. So I didn't want to do that. It's just extra points, and I'd rather have like speed cool or something. So I made the executive decision to uh, choose the boom hill over it. I'm pretty sure we got the one that's over there. Um, I should probably update you guys. So we finished the time trial now. What I'm doing is shooting these sharks. You get like a a hat from shooting them all. That makes it so you don't need uh, ABBA, which is you know, the the diving suit basically. You can wear that instead of wearing this, which means you can just carry the hacker wherever you want, which is super helpful, especially for the Easter egg since you do a lot of hacker stuff. Um, the shark mask is pretty hugely important for the, for the egg. That nuke, although, that one nuke that we got, it's gonna be pretty detrimental. We could have gotten a lot of points for doors. Now we're not. We're probably gonna have to hold off getting Jug for a little bit. You should like, get it on like 8 as soon as I open up to it. And then runs 9 and 10 are just point building to get to the rest of the doors. We can't do that now. Because I didn't get enough points. Or well, we'll see. I'm assuming at least because that was a pretty large chunk of round six we uh, weren't able to get points from because I had a nuke. Okay, I don't know exactly where that part is, but I know it's just the prompt is there, so. Where is the box? I don't know where that is. Okay. So that's the way we're going to go to open to labs. This is... Oh, I don't remember what this door is. I'm pretty sure that's... Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a way to hack the system. So, yeah, we're getting a... Uh... Okay, thank you, Richtofen. Um, This map is pretty heavy in frame drops. I'm I'm assuming especially right now because I'm uh, recording. So okay, perfect. This is what we want. We're not gonna have to open the other door. Mm. Yeah, we're gonna go use this. Get on to the next round. Come on. Yeah, yeah, that was it. Usually I'll just hold one, but I'm really gonna need points, so I'll take this as a blessing. Okay. I had done perfect. This is exactly what we want. We can trigger all of them through the the keypad at Pack a Punch, which is what we're mainly going to do. But it doesn't hurt to get some uh, RNG for Bio down there. All right, now we got to find the hacker. 
since we're going to get the shark helmet pretty much right away, we can get the hacker now instead of coming back and looking for it later. So we don't have to come back to this room at all. Perfect. Okay. We have the key, so we're going to go pick up the skull. Could you run with the skull, Dempsey? That was the question. Alright, we'll get down to last. Hopefully we don't swing into a nuke or something. Very possible. Oops. Okay. Well, he might be good for points. Yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna get the PhD prone. And if we get to pack a bunch, we can use code bank to get a thousand points, which is also pretty hugely important. Box is here, good to know. We're gonna need to spin that on round 11. Hopefully we get a harpoon. We'll see. Okay. Find the shark. Where is it? Where is the shark? Make sure the zombie doesn't hit me. I could go down pretty easily. There's supposed to be a shark there. There he is. Okay. Perfect. Nuke. We're going to ignore it. Okay. Oh, this might be good. Uh, we might actually have to hold off on jug. Probably be okay. Hopefully, we're actually pretty early. Actually, oh yeah, we are ahead for points. Well, maybe not, but kind of ahead. I don't have the other part. I thought I did. So silly. Can't grab it from the side, really. There. Okay. Looking pretty good for now. I don't know how good my game volume is. I'm just not realizing that you might not hear, you know, the lady on the intercom telling me about excavators. It's really just for my own ears, but it helps for you guys. Hopefully the volume is okay. I can only hope. So where's the shark? Must be across. No. Okay, so he's above where I can't shoot him. We're gonna wait then. 30 seconds. Ooh, we can actually... The biodome isn't even open yet, so yeah, we can go turn that off as soon as it's ready. Uh, we're just gonna shoot the shark first. There he is. Should be in range now. Dang, the zombie's fast. Perfect. It's to kill, alright. Gotta get the prone on dead shot first. Beautiful. Alright, that's Biodome. Gonna go turn it off now. So we can use that jump pad. And we can put on the shark helmet round 8, which means we can start the first three steps of the Easter egg now. That is really weird. That's what happens when you have low graphics, because I opened that other door. Usually I have to go through all of the other doors. And it's just super expensive, but, you know, I'm going to have to get to these other doors eventually, because I'm just going to have a whole... The flow of the map is just impeded by that door being opened, but... At least I, I can start stuff a bit earlier, which is pretty huge. Okay, we got to hit bank really quickly. Or, you know, as soon as we can. Start these Easter egg quests. I'm just gonna go turn off the excavator first. Shield's still not up yet. Biodome is the middle one, I'm pretty sure. 
Yeah. Please don't. Cool. Alright, he wasn't even really close. Oh. No, we can't take that pad yet because the door's not open. And I would drown anyway. So let's get the shark helmet. We'll float all these areas. Hit the excavators. Um, fun fact, if I, so, I'm not, I've, again, I'm just assuming you guys have a basic knowledge of how this map works. There's, like, a number pad in the pack lunch machine, uh, or in the submarine that houses the pack lunch machine. Uh, and you can put a bunch of codes in there to get stuff, like, there's ones to spawn power-ups, do stuff with the map, spawn, uh, you know, points, whatnot, grenades. There's all sorts of little codes. Um, wrong way. So, there. I mean, there are codes to get trigger the excavators to activate. Um, yeah, there's a respective code for each one. And we are going to use it pretty heavily to counter some of the RNG stuff that's in this map, which definitely sets this map apart from Moon, because most of the uh, RNG stuff is, you know, just that RNG. Anyway, we have the uh, shark suit now. Usually I have a pretty decent amount of perks at this point, but no, we don't even have jug, so that's pretty scary. We're gonna go hack these. These give us points. So, this is the first step of the Easter egg. We have to hack these panels and then find four buttons around the map. Might not even have some of them opened. Probably don't have some of them opened. Hopefully I don't get those. That'd be pretty unfortunate. Gotta make sure I bomb these. Two, three. Okay. Oh, I don't even. Oh, I do have cafeteria open. Never mind. Going insane. No, okay, so there's nothing on this side anymore. Yeah, the door's open. We can use this jump pad. Alright. Actually, you know what? We're gonna check this one. Should be able to hear it. Oh, this door's even open. That's great. I don't know if this door's supposed to be open. Well, that was actually pretty not what we wanted to do because it just sent me back. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. I'm really hoping this is through a door that I have opened. There are... There's the one at the entrance to Biodome that I definitely don't have open. I could open it, but I'd rather use the points toward the uh, jug. Because I'm going to need it. Possibly. We are severely ahead, I, I must uh, add. We are really, really ahead. I usually start this stuff two rounds from now. This is pretty, pretty big. Also, when you G-slide too quickly through the map, that's when you get consistent frame spikes, especially doing these uh doing these things since the map isn't really ready for you to hit these areas considering how fast you're going. Okay, hopefully it's over here in one of these two. Oh, okay, perfect. Okay. We can't open that door yet, but we can get to it through this door. Much more convenient. We're gonna hit this too. Yeah, 150 points. Pretty big. I don't know if we'll have enough. 150, 300, or... Maybe if I rebuild some barriers, I'll have enough for a jug. So that's gonna be pretty good. 
While we're here, we're gonna grenade this uh, window. I don't know if I have. I might have already done it. No, I haven't. All right. So that should be everything. All the areas flooded. Now we just need to hit the excavators. Then that should be the golden ABA. Uh, God mask. I didn't really look at the challenges. We can get the leaper one by mailing uh, leapers. I don't know how many it is. Now you can do it with the shield. I didn't hack the next one. I'm a daft prat. There's a zombie here. Okay, you need to come over here, buddy. Daddy's got to hack a button. Come on, bro. I could easily down here. That was scary. Right here? No. Okay. There's only one that's not open, I'm pretty sure. Only one button out of the seven. Not here, I don't think. Probably cafeteria, at least hopefully. Okay, look, I can. I don't know if I can hear it from here. All right. Rest in peace, Jug. Well, we got it. Not a big deal. If I, if I can open Biodome, I should have the shield built. Which is pretty good. And then... Um, by round 10, we should have... Everything done. I'm, j I'm probably going to just train and hold the zombie. So I can get the excavators just cleared out right away. So I can have Golden ABA. You know, for efficiency. That'd be pretty uh, good. Why that button... Not be green. Is that just like a visual thing? I hacked this one. Are you green? Be green. Better not bugged out on me. Okay, well that was delayed. That's three. One more. Should be this one. That's a nope. Access denied. Go up top here. Hey, climb up here. Hey, buddy. Uh oh. That one better be done. I swear to God. Okay. We should be able to get all these buttons. At least from my memory. Don't think there's one that is out of my reach. Beautiful. <sighs> Alright, well we can get a lot done right now. I really hope I pull the harpoon gun relatively quickly. I don't know if I'm going to go straight for the boom Hilda. I probably will since it's going to be pretty big for the boss fight. You know, the mini boss fight. To get the one inch punch. All we'll really need is that and like a high bullet gun, like an AR or an LMG. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. Those box pulls, but we'll see. It's like a 50-50 chance of pulling a good one. Okay, yeah, this button is just not on for some reason. 
Forever. Yeah, so we need to get a sub filled with uranium and bring it to him to power his thingy thing. And we're going to use the guy that's trapped in that room to uh, get access to that. Through the power of the Easter egg step. So he's trapped in there. We need to somehow get him out of there. Seriously? Oh. I took all my cash. I'm going to shoot the zombie twice. Where is he? Zombino. Maybe this will be a barrier I can rebuild. I just want to build a shield right now. That's going to be pretty helpful. Yeah. Perfect. Awesome. Alright, cool. It's the shield done. We can go ahead and build that by taking the long route. Go ahead and place this. Alright. Now, what am I doing? I, oh, I need to get into the sub. It's coming right now. Perfect. So we're going to hit a bunch of codes. Hopefully we'll be able to hit them all. Okay, so we need... The first one we need is, let's try bank. Actually, let's do some of these excavators. So we hit biodome. Let's do tunnel 11, because that's the one I need for the Easter egg. So that's bird. B. I. R. D. Okay, and then we'll do bank. points um blah, blah, blah. we could use fire sale not now we'll save that make some be slow for a certain time can i do both i don't want to break it yeah i guess that's all we need now okay those are the big ones we could have used those points for you know something useful but we had to buy a door feels bad we're going to have to buy a bunch of doors once you do the x mission for What's-His-Face. He makes you open pretty much every door during that x mission. So we're going to make sure we have all those doors open before we start it. So we can just do it all in one round very conveniently. Um, oh yeah, so we have to follow the wires. I need to pull up Lex. Mr. T. Mr. T. Lex. Fly. Where the valve go past the room where the guy is there itself. Okay, I just needed this little document. Thank you very much. So I have a schematic that makes it so I don't have to follow wires. I can just look at what monitor it is and it'll tell me which one. So that's this one. Okay, number two. C is over here. I can't do anything until that excavator goes down because it bugged out my game before. That's really unfortunate because it was a pretty good run. And then uh, A over here. So now he has to do moon, Simon says. Hello. I don't have a shield. This might be terrible. Just back and forth right now. I'm gonna make sure he gets away. Okay, people, people, bam. Whoa. Well, last one, I'm pretty sure. I think that was yellow. Here we go. 
Ah, what the? <sighs> um, I'm actually gonna build a shield. That'll make this a lot less scary. <sighs> I couldn't get to it. Zombie was creeping up on me. I don't know if it's random or a set of combinations, but there are some easy combinations. Like sometimes it's just the same one over and over. Too quick. I'd rather fail than you know die or move on to the next round. I'll get it eventually. Yeah. This might be it. Vader, about to go off. Make sure I take care of that. This is so easy. I don't want to jinx it. Oh my god, the zombie blocked me, bro. Come on, mate. Come on, man. That was going to be it. I totally jinxed it. All right, had to be done. So I need to take care of the excavator since Tunnel Eleven's a big transport for the, you know, the map. But the round just went off. I probably will die if I try to go for it, but we'll see. Drag is number one priority right now. I need it. So the round ended. That's fine. Not hugely a big deal. Let's see. Thousands of Tunnel eleven is this one. Yeah, that's probably fair. I do have a shield. Perfect. All right. Well, in the starting room, this is pretty. Actually, now I can take the biodome. Yeah, we'll take the biodome jump pad. I don't know what those are. Zombies are following me. It's pretty spooky. You know, let's fill this soul box since we're point building. Let's fill this now. Don't have to worry about it later. We can just jump right into the boss fight as soon as we're ready. But we need to save one this round big time. Usually I'm filling this in like round 12, but hey, here we are. It's very hard to see these zombies since this whole area is underwater. But we kind of have to have these areas flooded for the easter egg. It's not really a big deal for gameplay since you can just have a mask that makes it so there's basically no water except for the water physics the discount anti-grav mm. nice holy hell in a hand basket that did something set a Dempsey Okay, let's get Jug. Looking pretty good. Tunnel 11's flooded. We have all the stuff we need for the Easter egg. The rest is... Down to points. Like, map requirements for the Easter egg. We have everything. Me too, Dempsey. Me too. Okay. So, let's try this again. Maybe we can use an, a grenade to make a crawler. See if that works. I'm too scared. I'm just going to end the round. We'll try it. I'm pretty sure we have two zombies or something like that right now. We'll try to grenade one of them and see if we make a crawler. Perfect. What was it? This one. 
Oh, this is, uh... Well... This is some pretty spectacular RNG. Ba 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 Okay. Okay. Four five eight five four five eight five. Four five eight five. He can probably escort what's his face this round. We won't have the guns to protect him, but actually we might. Yeah, let's do it right now. Well, I'll, we have some other stuff to do, of course, but uh, so long as this zombie doesn't die, we can do a bunch this round. Do a pretty sizable bunch. And now we have to wait for the submarine. This is just some waiting around. Since it patrols the map, we just gotta wait for it to jump in, too. Debating whether I should use these points to open doors or buy like speed cola or save them for a pack bunch. I think I'm gonna do that. I'll see how many points I have at the time I need to throw the wrench in. And uh, I'll probably spin the box once and then uh, hopefully I get something good. And then I'll pack bunch my boom hilda. We'll do the mini boss fight, get the one inch punch. Um. And we'll see what we have left over in terms of points for perks and uh, maybe even a pack of for the other gun I pull. Depending on what I get, that is. Alright, here's the sub. Go ahead and jump in. 4585. Five. 4585. Five. Enter. We get the valve. Look at now. Now I just need to place this valve in uh, certain locations around the base. Then we get another code, then we have to do some codes on the valves, and then we escort the guy, he gives us the upgrade for the thingy, and then we blow up the submarine, and then we transport... Actually, we can do a lot this round. We can do way more than I thought, so long as... I mean, there might be some complications with zombie killing once we get to escorting, since it spawns Nova Crawlers, and if I, have, I have to like hold a Nova Crawler. That's gonna be pretty, pretty annoying. So we might go on to a uh, round here and there, but hopefully that doesn't happen. You can only hope. Here's number two. We have all the rooms we need for the uranium escort. Number three. Don't remember exactly where to go from here. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I remember now. I'm gonna have to open a door. I'm thinking. It's a convenience door. This door is really good to have open, so we'll have it open. I did build it. Okay. Still not going to open that door since it's just redundant. It's not a huge inconvenience to just take the jump pad and go in from this angle. It's a pretty pricey door too, so I'm just gonna leave it there. My points are better used elsewhere. So now we have the valves down. We have to go get a code from Guy. Not from him, but you know, his room. Okay, so here it is. The code is two five one three two. You don't follow them chronologically there. It goes based on the colors, it's just like a really discreet thing. I needed to hit the next excavator. This room. I should have hit that while I was in there putting the code for the valve. Since we just got tunnel eleven. And then I'll have gold maybe a We'll see what I can do. Since we're going to be around Biodome, if the sub comes by, I'll definitely hop in. 
to put that code in so you don't have to not deal with that until like any convenient time you can just have it that'd be pretty huge since golden ABA gives you a pretty sizable benefit through uh, another hit of jug are you coming down? no okay put this file down two five Three, two. Tell you what. Two. Maybe I didn't hit this one. Hello? Hang on, Lex, help me. Lex, I'm just going to double check I have the code order now. And the fifth digit is the third number. Or number, the fourth... Your second yeah, yeah. digit is the fourth number. Fifth My code is right. Third number. First, I'm gonna make sure I got the valve order right. Put one of the three in the valve on exactly where I put each of these valves. Tell you what, I probably didn't turn. I don't think I turned the one at submarine facility. You know, the computer room. I don't think I turned that one. <laughs> to be honest. And double check. Yeah, my order is definitely right. Since we're going, you know, to the neighboring room for that, did I turn this? Yeah, I did. I did. I didn't put the one at cafeteria. I'm a fool. I didn't put it at cafeteria, did I? No, I did. I did. All right. Well, I don't want to have to come backtrack, so we'll just check if the code's right, and then I'll check if all my valves are right. Maybe I didn't turn a few of them. Whatever. So first time I did it. Yeah. Third digit. Fourth digit. Yeah, it's correct. Hang on. Follow. He's down. This order. Third is the third number, or just. Last digit, th okay, yep. So this is the first valve. That got turned. Second valve is upstairs. Third valve is cafeteria. Fourth valve is next to the buildable table at next to spawn. And the fifth one is M16 hallway. I'm on to the second location right now. While I'm running around doing this, it would have been nice to have x ray going off. So this is the second one. It's turned. There's no prompt for it. Let's check cafeteria. 100% sure I put this one down. Yeah, and it's turned. Ooh, tell you what. I think I paused when I placed this one down and I didn't turn it. Maybe that was it. Maybe that was it. Please tell me I turned this one. I did. And then M16 hallway. Those are the right colors too. I don't know if the colors matter. Let's just open this door. <laughs> yeah, I can't hold E on it. It seems correct. My code is right. Maybe the valves are wrong. I don't know. Maybe I did get it and it didn't, it just didn't give me like a thingy, you know. Actually, we can't really do anything. We need to wait for doors to open. We won't do the escort yet. Because he takes us around the map and requires us to open doors. If we start that, we'll, we can't stop it. We'll just be skipping rounds like nobody's business. So we'll, we'll point build first, but I'm going to make sure that the code is right. That's a yeah. That's a two. That's a five. That's a one. That's a three. 
That's a two. I'm gonna nudge this one. Maybe that's it. No, it's just not. Hello? Alright, whatever. So now we're building points for Pack a Bunch, I believe. Watch out for the gas hags! Um. <sighs> this is pretty inconvenient. We're gonna fire my bullets so we don't get the free perk. Since I can screw up my four perks that I want. It's helpful, but it can also inconvenience me. It's based on RG. Let's just not have it. Ooh, we get a lot of points with these guys. Yes, please. Brilliant. Okay. Um, well, we got a spin box now, since it's round 11. That's really unfortunate. Where was that? It's at a PhD. Okay. Could pull a wall weapon, but I get a chance at harpoon gun, which is crucial for the egg. It's better this way. Spin it. Well, that's not what I wanted. Let's do another spin. I really need a point gun. This is not going to service me. Well, this is not even... Wow, this is actually really terrible. I'm 100% sure my cult would do better. Please. Anything. Come on, man. At least this kills zombies. Usually I get spectacular RNG. I got a Galil last game. Usually I get the RPK. This is pretty abysmal. Well, we have some rounds of just point wasting. No, Dempsey. I need to remember I have my specialist. Tell you what, let's just pull that out now. Time seems right. That does not give us many points. Dude, this has got to be a joke. Great, I, I'm going to get so many points from this. Come the freaky frack on, man. I think we're just going to go with a wall gun. Get like an MP5. I don't even know if that'll do well. I really need something with power, and those are only in the box. I could grab like the M16. Really not what I want to do. MP40 maybe. It's got a pretty reliable amount of ammo and damage. Uh, I kind of just want to keep spinning the box. I'm gonna need to anyway. It might be a worse call, but it'll it'll benefit me just as soon as it decides to give me something good. Oh come on, insta kill! Stay with me. Don't leave me with the ray gun, no. I can't make any points with this thing. Foul. I'll take it. Oh, I might not take it. This is an AR. It's pretty... Uh, I mean, it's semi-automatic, but it's got power. Better than nothing. What am I thinking? I can take the Boom Hilda. What have I been doing? I've just been sp Okay, I'm sticking with the foul. This is pretty good. But I need to pack the boom hilda. Okay, I, I turned my brain off for a second here. Don't worry, guys. I'm back. Being smart. Alright, that's all I needed. Once we're packed, we can just redo that boss fight. Pretty immediately. Not that the boss fight is hugely important. I haven't checked my challenges. I need to do that. I also need to grab double tap. Uh, okay, let's just wait for the submarine here. 
Boom Hilda, then we're also gonna hit code. We need zero pi, which is zero seven four three oh seven four three. So we're gonna hit that as well as pack a punch. Here it is. Here's my ride. Um that's pretty much all we have right now. We're okay for now. I need to get perks big time and I also need to get a decent pull from the box. That should be in my future. Throw it in. Okay. Zero seven four three, is that correct? Zero. I didn't even Are you serious? Well, let's try again. Oh hey. That's pretty cool. Whoop. Please just zero seven four three. Perfect. That's golden what's its face. But we can't do the boss fight because it'll bug out the excavator. And I won't be able to use that code again. It'll stop and the code will have already registered as being used. So we're just going to train until um, until it goes off, I'm afraid. What up, my guy? Again, I can't edit anything, so if you're watching this. This is the perfect time to go get a snack because it takes forever for this guy to come down. Usually about like one and a half minutes, maybe just a little bit longer. Not hugely. Like I'm not gonna be sitting here waiting for like a rocket test on DE. That usually takes upwards of like two or three minutes. It shouldn't be that big, but. It's going to be a decent amount of time with just like no talking and just me running around in circles waiting for this to get done. Maybe two or three minutes. It takes about a minute for it to just let you know that it's happening. It is two minutes, I'm pretty sure. And then um, it'll start counting down, like 60 seconds, 30 seconds, and then it'll go off. So we're, we're I think, 45 seconds through. About to hit. You know. The halfway point, as it were. Actually, it might be longer than that. This feels like longer. There we go. Last minute, boys. Last minute. Hold on to your hats. Let's go wait at spawn to deactivate it. Submarine launch facility is. The one on the left. As I come in, it's the one on the left. Warning, excavator pi will cause decompression of submarine launch facility in 30 seconds. 29, 28, 
21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, and there it goes, 2, 1. Alright, well that was Golden ABA. Very lovely. And I'm also gonna need that, uh, that hallway. It's a pretty big travel place for me. So, uh, get out of town, Excavator. Thanks for the points, but wouldn't want to be you. We're gonna get a Golden ABA before we go into the boss fight, and then we're gonna do it. One edge punch. I still need to check my challenges. I'll get around to that at some point. Heck you, Excavator. You chill. And Excavators can still come down even when the rooms have been flooded. Which is lovely. So we're still gonna have to deal with them even once we're long gone. The, long past the use of them. Since we only need Tunnel 11 to be excavated. For the Easter Egg and Biodome. But we also got this one, which is helpful for, you know, getting the mask, which is helpful in itself. So we got it. Golden Abia. That's my first time getting it, by the way. Awesome. Looking pretty good. The only thing is... The box being a big butthole. And not giving me the guns I want. So I would have found. Hopefully I do well in the egg. Or the you know the boss fight room. I don't have a tremendous amount of ammo, and it's entirely possible that I could die. I don't have double tap or anything. I have no way of getting double tap unless I like wait for an excavator to come down, but those are round based, so no, we can't do that. We're just gonna we're just gonna do it. <coughs> Excuse me. Talking my throat. And hopefully we get it done. Without dying. That would be... That would be recommended. We're also gonna need some taxes. It's not hugely difficult, it's just ammo can... is definitely has the possibility of becoming a problem. If I don't be careful. <sighs> it's crazy how optimal you get when you play this map a bunch, because I've been playing it a bunch. I really can't... I've never played a custom zombies map this much. Because these are, you know, relatively difficult. Especially with how much it demands of you. Um, and, you know, the side Easter eggs you're required to do. Does it? I don't know where his weak spot is. I just kind of go for his head. Find the boom hilda infinitely more helpful for this egg because Whoa oh no 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 They got out a shield there. Yeah. I was hurting for ammo during the uh using it with them I was saying tally. This one I was uh, just kinda I had a bunch of ammo left. Which is hugely helpful. Boom Hill though, way better than uh, Mustang and Sally. Mustang and Sally gang. It's pretty cool how they give you the choice too. Like at the start, you just knife a panel in the submarine and there's a mouse that just chilling there. Oh god, I hate this. Doesn't. I'm pretty sure those grenades don't do as much damage as they're supposed to because. Oh my god, I'm like the dumbest man. Why are you laughing at me, bro? Let's go fish 
Oh my Holy crap, that was close, wasn't it? Well, so was he, so there he goes. Bye bye zombies. Oh, he actually gives some souls or something. Oh, it's to you know, yeah. I get it. Hello. Down they go. Okay, he's almost done. God, I get. I'm getting hit with those way more in this one than in other attempts at this. Getting the full clip there. Yeah. I resent your advice. Okay. Let's get out of here. Better gun is definitely on my list right now, but we have our one inch punch. Which we need to get the Vril device. So we can go grab that now. Via labs. Now, seriously, all we need to do is point build. And get the harpoon gun. Really gonna need it. I'm gonna grab double tap right now. Yeah, we definitely need double tap. That took way too long. I was about to say maybe speed cola, but no. Definitely not not the play. So double tap, and then what was I gonna do? I forgot. I need to check my challenges. That's not extraordinarily new. We have a whole new round of zombies. That's pretty cool. If you go into the boss fight, it like gives you a brand new round. Like I was on one when I went in, and now we have a pretty sizable one of zombies that I can get points from. Pretty awesome. Yeah, this is basically a whole round. Only round. This is. This is just hugely ahead. I forgot this happened. This is pretty great. I have enough for all my perks. And on uh, the next guy round, you know, the leapers, I can use a shield and get free perks. But I'm getting double tap speed cooler. You could get vigor rush or whatever, but it makes it extraordinarily hard to save a zombie. Which I don't exactly like, and it's also more expensive. I just prefer double tap. They both essentially do something like double damage, except Vigor Rush is more of explosive rounds, and it can kill a whole horde or zombies next to each other. Okay, so that's the specialist. Kill zombie while using a jump pad. I can do that right now. Consecutive rounds in the lab. I'm gonna hack that. Not right now, though. Do I have two left? Please tell me I do. Alright, whenever I kill this uh, zombie... I'm gonna make sure I kill him with the jump pad. What up, sub? I did not mean to go on you. Anything I can do? Uh, Responds a diver boss, max ammo, nuke, recharge trident, throw a grenade, zombie slow. Fire sale! Let's do fire sale. 3473. Three. Three, four, seven, three. I didn't grab it. I thought it would activate. Did that? Am I screwed now? God. <laughs> I would have liked that. That would have given me three good box hits for the price of like a tenth, like a twentieth of the normal price. 
Well over the toilet the double bars. Well that sucks. Maybe it'll not Oh no, there's no way. I'm not gonna be able to use the code again. <sighs> I keep missing double tap, I forget it's in that room. Let's get double tap. Okay. I wonder if this stuff makes you faster, or if it just makes everything else slow down. I need to find a jump pad. Next round, what am I doing? I have points, I have Boom Hilda. I need to open doors. I just need a, one more round to open doors, and then I can do the escort mission. On top of everything else for the Easter egg. I really need that harpoon gun. That's the only thing I need. God. I have all my perks ready. I have pretty much everything I need. Ooh. Let's let's see if I can hit it again. I doubt I will, but it's worth a try. Three, four, seven, three. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it it counted. That's so sad. That would have been helpful. Yeah, we're zombie. Zombie, zombie, zombie. I forget that um, when it's dropping a power up, it actually drops it behind you. I thought it would be. I thought uh, it was like the bank where it just gave me the points, where it could have dropped like a, a you know, a, a blood money or whatever. But, you know, it uh, dropped the power up and I didn't grab it. Because I thought it was going to immediately activate. I wanted to get out of there and get my hits in. Where's the zombie? I need to hit him with the jump pad. Zombie. Hello. Can you stand right over here? There's no way I'm going to be able to hit him. Nice. First try. Okay, so that's the max ammo. We don't care about that one. We're just going to try to get them to see if we can get the god mask. It's worth a try at least. Uh, we just need a round of points, and I have the one-inch punch, so I can use that. I should probably train up a bunch so I can get the kills with the specialist done as well. Since that's also a challenge I need to get done, I'd rather do it now when I'm killing zombies, rather than when I'm not. Although I don't get nearly as many points from using specialists as with, you know, like a one-inch punch or something. But, yeah, I'm not Oh, that door isn't open, isn't it? I don't think I need this door. I do actually need this door open. I need all of them open, so... Let's just open it. Hola. I'm trying to find over here. I want to train down in this big open area underwater. I want to take a look at how sizable this area is. It's beautiful. This is like the best training space in the history of forever. Okay. So we're just going to train them all up, use our specialist on them. I need 50 kills. Uh, it's probably going to take a while. Hopefully, I don't know how many points I'm going to get from this. I could probably get four to five grand if I fired in this horde with my foul right now. Let's see how much we get with the specialist. A thousand. Oh, that was it. Okay. Thank God. I really did not want to do that anymore. It really hurts my point gain. So that's... Uh... Oh, it didn't end the round. What are any points for? Doors. Correct the mundo. Okay. I don't even know if I did the code right. It was just a hunch. All right, let's see if. Okay. 
Is he down there? You are. Is this last? I think it is. Okay. So let's see if we got the code right. If I did get the code right, the door should swing open. I'm fairly certain, at least. Here we go. Pretty please. Tell me that. No. Okay. Uh, lame. I did the valves right. I don't know what's up. Do I need a new code? Can I get a new code? Usually it just opens. I'm not sure what the hubbub is about. I did put the code in. I have the valves. It's not about that. Did I place these wrong? Lex, help me. What am I doing? Yeah. And these are definitely Place correct. Each of these down. This is also the steam trap which will help you. After placing each of these down, this is all oh, gives you a free perk. Trials. The oh, hey, it gives you a free perk. I should probably I do that. Activate steam trap. What else you need a valve? Well, that's not really for the egg. Lex. Lex. And look at the code numbers that have fallen. Your code is going to be a five digit code and it's going to be an. I know, Lex. I've, I know. I've tried this Easter egg at least 20 times. I've done this step. It always works. Why no worky now? Why no worky, Lex? I'll check again. Let me check again. Two, five, one, three. I'm the dumbest. A I'm so stupid, guys. I had two on there twice. No one, no one talked to me for a good three days. I'm really gonna, gonna need to let that one sink in as punishment for being dumb. I can't believe that. I should have noticed that there were two twos. It's one of the first five numbers. This is supposed to be number four. Oh, uh, how embarrassing. Okay, which way to labs? This way. I just have a seizure in the door. Hello? Oof. Overly complicated door mechanisms. Who designs this underwater facility? I don't know. Okay. Let's get you those crystals. Yeah, let's get me those crystals. Pretty please. Even though I don't have the harpoon gun yet, I'll I'll take him. Okay, well he's gonna go down. That's fine. So you have to escort him and he'll get down and we need to revive him, whatever. As long as the zombie doesn't die and we can let him down as much as we want, doesn't really matter. As long as he gets from point A to point B. I'm gonna try to get the zombie behind me and like cart him around and then like Make it so he doesn't really kill my shield because I'm going to need it. This is a pr fairly long escort mission. We can just kind of train him around and push Dr. What's-His-Face ahead. And, uh... Can you just... Rocket side. Yeah. I think it was this way. Uh, no, this you way. take it what, this way. Alright, so now we get Nova Crawler. So long as this zombie doesn't die, I shouldn't end up with a Nova Crawler. Please don't... Beautiful. Okay. There's like four of these Nova Crawler sections where he stops to talk about something and then Nova Crawler spawn. Um. Okay, well, there he goes. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Dude, why is a zombie so fast? Boop. It just. Yeah, yeah. Don't, uh. Don't have a shield there. He is so fast. I'm not gonna be able to get anywhere. I'm gonna have to stop escorting him to get a new shield, because Jesus. Here's another Nova Crawler section coming up. God, here goes my shield in this stupid hallway. Stop hitting me. A tunnel? Uh, I mean, uh, uh, this way. Yeah, this way. Yeah, there's no way this guy's not going down right now. 
Yeah. Just gonna deal with these Nova Crawlers and then pick them up. Get over here. Stop it. Just gonna go down right again. Oh, he's stuck in him, is he? Okay, cool. Kill him. Okay. There were still Nova Crawlers anyway. Ba -ba -ba -ba. God, here goes my shield. I wish I should be able to pick up a new one. We walk past the buildable table at some point during the mission. It's at one hit left. God, here it goes. I'm going to try to hit, have him hit me instead of my shield. Oh, there it goes. Here, it's, it's right here. I'm just going to grab it. wasn't that bad. Didn't realize we were going to come get back, you know, come near it. English. I didn't realize we were going to come near it, so, uh, fairly quickly. Whatever. He's going to go to the biodome right now. This zombie is stupidly fast right now. I have no idea why he's this fast. They're usually, like, a relatively slow. Can you move? Doctors, have you, you embarrassed yourself? I hope you know. Please, I you, I'm right here. Kill me. Zombies give me so much trouble. Okay. Just boop him along. Super tedious. I mean, it's fairly difficult, I guess. And just how time consuming it is in your management skill. Ooh, he, almost, he was going for him there. I need to buy this door for him. He's probably going to get hit by the zombie. Nope. Yeah, okay. Okay, here's another overcrawler section. Hello. Should be more. Yeah. What's up? Okay, that might be it. I don't know. Little a couple stragglers somewhere. Yes, hit me. Can you jump in it from here? I didn't know that it went this way. I think we're about done ish. Yeah. We go back to labs. And then, yeah. This is almost the end, kind of. God, this is so long. I mean, you don't really need to be set up. You just need to have money for doors, which is like the last thing you're going to use your points on. Since you only need the amount of doors that you need to get around the map to the place you need to go. But you need to open the doors that he wants you to open. It's just super tedious. I think he's going to down here, probably. If I dipped my head in that portal, left him to die, that would have been unfortunate. I need to buy this door for labs since this is where he's going. I just, oh, nice. Don't hit him. Don't you hit him. I'm just gonna have my shield get broken here since I can just grab a new one.
I wonder if once you get the crystal, your um, it pushes the harpoon in the in the box. Cause I've I've never really hit for it before I got the crystal, but afterwards it was always like kind of my first pull. I don't I can't quite remember, but I'm I'm fairly certain it was like relatively like early in my pulls of the box. Maybe if that was it, that'd be pretty cool, and I would love that. Since I don't want to just hit the box all day to get a harpoon gun, just to continue the Easter egg. Not that I really need it, but it's pretty. It's well, it's basically the wonder weapon for the map. This looks familiar. Yeah, but it does. Yes. This way. I'm sure of it. It's quite hilarious because um, it's like the first place we go, and we have to go all the way around the map. Only for him to find out that oh, it was in front of him the whole time, and he was just a dum dum. So that's pretty funny, haha. -ha. Yep, you uh, take your time, there, buddy. Not like we have stuff to do. Let's spin the box. Why don't we? And a teddy bear. That's that's just fitting. First you take my money, now you fly away, bitch. Okay. My cooker. Actually, we need this door open. Pretty pretty helpful door to have open there. Otherwise, you have to go around the whole map. So, release the mine. Now we wait for the sub to come by. We blow it up to get the uranium, transport the uranium through the underwater rooms. And then other stuff happens. I don't quite remember. We have to charge the uranium, I'm pretty sure. As soon as you get the pearl device. Perfect. Down it goes. To come down right here. B H D. Come on, big boy. All right. So uh, you have to transport this through underwater buildings, lest it explode. So there's like a little path that uh, has been made and how to do this. You have to have certain rooms flooded. Transport it through them. Thank god we got some lovely RNG to help us out. And also some keypad. But there go all our points. Thank god I got a teddy bear because if I didn't I wouldn't have had enough points to transport this. Where do I go? I still can't transport it. I need to open this door. This is a thousand door. Yeah, alright, well, what's in there on then? Still the hacker, right? Yeah, it overrides my little icon. I thought it would. I traded it for something or something. We just need to get a thousand and then we can transport this. Ooh, that's nasty. I really want to not have that happen. Better hack that. Seriously? Oh, it's Who not. Took all my cash? That's annoying. Okay. Now we can continue. We actually have to do some pretty uh, intense running. Oh, I still need to open this door. We have to basically open every door on the map right now. this door was. Oh my god, that zombie came out of that door. He would have cut me off if I wasn't just such a gamer. Oh 
Ooh, that was scary. Power to the stasis port has been funny. Something is wrong. The source of uranium must have decayed over the years. We still require energy to utilize the green fire. There exists an ancient energy source hidden deep within the earth. If you can extract this energy and bring it to me, my body can become the host to a pure. Okay, this is the part that I do not remember. I think I just need to... Yeah, okay, charge uranium from the thingy thing. This is where I kind of want a harpoon gun. So, let's see if we can pull it. If we get it relatively quickly, that would be nice. A man can only dream... Let's see, well, if it... If it puts the odds toward Harpoon Gun, we should pull it right now. That is a G11. No, that's an HS10. I don't have eyeballs. So it doesn't. I'm just super lucky. And that's a ray gun. And I'm going to have to hack that before I forget. That sucks. We kind of... I kind of need a Harpoon Gun, you know? Submarine launch facility. This one. Nope. That's this one. User access, denied. access denied. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. I do not have anything on my shield. I gotta hack this. Hack, 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 hack. Oh, is that speed cola? Ooh, and that gave me a thousand points. I forgot about that. Awesome. And, um... I mean, roll to be set up. I just need, a uh, Harpoon gun. And the points to pack a bunch of it, and hopefully we pull it right now. Hey, this is good for points. It's not what I wanted, but it's good for points. Really, really liked to... Oh, you're right there. Ooh, I don't have a shield though. Why is the excavator making noise? Hacks? Oh hey, well I'm gonna need a shield. Actually, which which reward is um which reward is the free pack a bunch gun? Because if you use the hacker. You can get um, the wonder weapon that way. I really need a shield because I want a free perk. Take care of these suckers. Hello. Pretty sure they hit through the shield. That's the leaper helmet. It's a downgrade, but hey, we got it. So you can get that via shield hits. Oh, well, there it goes. There's so many. Pretty sure I'm down to the last wherever he is. Here and there he is. PhD. Hey, I'll take it. I uh, will take it. Where is the box? It's over there. It's pretty much exactly the opposite of where I need to be here now. If I can go through biodome to get there quicker. I can go through the biodome. Um, is there a bounce pad here? I don't think there is. It's pretty sucky. Is 
So we're gonna see which reward was the thingy thing. And if it's if it's blue, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if it's blue, but if it's blue, that'll be great because then I, that's the one I've completed, and I can hopefully get a harpoon gun from it. I don't know if it's the harpoon gun. Thousand zombies, one Dempsey. Yeah, that's probably fair. Yeah, that's probably fair. They only have like two quotes from this for this map. Okay. Are you the free? Okay, yeah, it is. How much to hack? Fifteen hundred. And we're gone. I'm gonna get some points. I don't know if it's worth it to do that. I don't know if I should just keep spinning the box or what. It's um, slightly pricier than a box hit. Yeah, I can jump in it from here. Cool. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think there's really anything I need. Hey, you brought me here. That's where I was going. Okay, um... I think... I'm gonna hit the box. I don't know what the odds are to pull the Wonder Weapon from that. I'm gonna say... I prefer the old-fashioned way. Good old box spin. Actually, there's probably more points if I just shoot. Yeah. Ooh, that's a lot of zombies. Mark two. Um, we'll get rid of the boom, Hilda. I should probably pack much mark two. Um, we'll wait for the submarine. Mark two. Pretty sure this is yeah. This is definitely an upgrade from the boom, Hilda. Boomhild is lighter, but this is more ammo, and it's probably more powerful. Uh, yeah. Sucks that I have to throw away... Well, I don't technically have to throw it away, but... I would have liked to have to not pack a bunch of this, you know. But I guess it services me in the end. It's a better gun. Not the one I wanted, but a better gun nonetheless. Oh, here it comes. I was about to say I'm gonna go train somewhere else, but nope. I can jump in it from here. Very certain. Let me get up on the stairs nonetheless. Awesome. Really need the harpoon gun. Really need it. I wonder if I don't need it if I have the crystal. No, I probably do need it. There's no way. I just thought that would be nice and not have to get me use RNG to pull it out of the box. It's so frustrating. Okay. Round 17. I think this is a... Okay, so that's really interesting. That's the boss zombie theme, basically. You know, the submarine guy? Pull that. But his theme is Prowler. From uh, Into the Spider-Verse. 
Every time I hear that, I'm like, what? Who's watching Spider Verse? It's pretty inconvenient, buddy. I wanted to spin the fire sale. And here you are, ruining my day. Where's that crossbow? I only got two spins because this nerd decided to come in the round I got a fire sale. Just get out of my life, man. Sure, Dempsey. What is that? Tell me it's a point gun. It's a sniper. Thanks. Not what I wanted, but I guess thanks. I don't even know if this is an upgrade. It probably isn't. QEDs. I'm pretty sure I need these for the boss fight. Or the Easter egg at large. That's a specter. Zombies, one Dempsey. Yeah, that's probably fair. I'm starting to think I should have uh, spun the hacker. Wave gun. I don't need it. It's not that good. Particularly for like boss fights and stuff. It, it's good for zombies, but don't really need it. You yeah, know. Really don't like going rounds. I like doing Easter egg steps and not just saying you're spinning the box for my life. That's a foul. I've already had this. Yeah, that's probably fair. CZs. Better for points. Nice and beautiful for points. Ooh, tell me that's a double points. That is a nuke. The opposite of what I want. Give it deep. What did it do? Can I hack the box? Pretty sure I can. I don't remember what that does. What does that do exactly? I'm gonna do it. Hopefully it'll give me a good thing. It might just spin it for free. That's probably what it does. We'll see that. are pretty fast. I don't know if I'll be able to hack it. I don't remember what it does. I'm just going to see because I really have no other alternatives. I can't. I can't hack the box. Okay, never mind. Thought you could. Foul. Pretty cool if you could hack the box. You know. That's a teddy bear. Really depressed. So stupid. I didn't want a new gun anyway. I'm gonna hack the reward. Worth the try. At least he gives me like a pack punch gun, better than you know whatever trash the box can give me. Don't have a shield. That's a different gun than last time. What's that? Why well, did it? It cost me money. 
Better give me something. What is that? That's a China Lake. Yeah, I'm gonna let it go away and see if it gives me something new. I don't even know if you need to hack it. Pretty sure it was a specter before, and then it was like a dragon off or something, so... Yeah, no, that's China Lake. Okay. I'm just gonna spend the box. I don't know where that is. And your shield, too. This is really unfortunate. I mean, it's not too detrimental to the run. It could be if this key continues, but I was on a roll. Oh, the box over here. Please. Ooh, RPK, that's good. Oh, man. I. Okay. Tell you what. Do we really need the harpoon gun? I'm just going to spin to see if I can get it. But I've heard Lex says Mark II in RPK, and this is ex exactly that. I really don't want to have to throw this in just to get the harpoon gun. I don't think you really need it. The crystal's part of the upgrade, but. You know, it's not a part of the Easter egg, really. Yeah, but they're trying to like. We're just gonna continue with egg. Gonna continue with the egg. See if I can get it. Like I don't know. It's really only useful for this step because it's essentially um, a lockdown immediately after we complete this step. And if you use like the upgraded uh, harpoon gun, it didn't. You can shoot it and make it really easy, but we just did lock in the normal way, and it should be okay. You will see. <clears throat> Too late now. I'm going back. Got to kill them from over here. Oh. Oh, it's infinite zombies, is it? Whoopsie. I did not get the memo. I did not know it was infinite zombies. Also, when you fire LMGs in the water, the game can sometimes crash. Pretty sure. Yeah, more space on this side, so just stand on this side. I know this is not the optimal way to do it. Yeah, that's probably fair. Lex just has you shoot the harpoon gun on one side and have them walk into it. Really wish I could do that, but I just spent like five rounds hitting the box and I didn't get it. I'd rather, rather than not. Detriment the run. Yeah, um, let's just do it. Okay, I don't remember where the first one is. Pause this real quick. The labs. Okay, so lab. Shit, Whoops. Did not mean to do that. Labs is this way. Oh, the basically the whole thing of this is like the power is off. This is a rather long lockdown. I don't have a pack of much RPK. And I can't get ammo. I just gotta train them here. And kill only the ones that go for it. Oh, that's actually a lot. Oh my god, my ammo. I can one-inch punch them. Easy. I've been told to save the specialist for the second one. Because a boss zombie comes. Oh my god. Anyone else want to have some fun? Let's see. Thousand zombies, one Dempsey. Yeah, that's probably fair. Oh my god. These zombies are essentially body blocking me from dealing with the ones that are breaking it. How long is this? Okay, so it's not zombie kills dependent, it's just time, apparently. Oh my god. 
I can't get my perks back. Is this the end? This is so the end. All because I didn't pull the harpoon gun. Oh my god. There's no way to get my perks. I have to do the rest of this without perks. And I have like no ammo too. This is definitely the end. At least I have perma jug. I guess. This is all your fault, box. All the box. What? Where is it? What? No! That would have been it if I had the harpoon gun. I'm so upset. The whole thing went off the deep end. Just because I couldn't pull the harpoon gun. Really? I wish it was like... Um... Mob of the Dead, where there's the, you can pull it from the box, you can also get a free one. Same thing with Voyage of Despair, you can get a free Kraken. I think that would have been so awesome if there was some way to get a free harpoon gun. Devs for Leviathan, if you're watching this. Patch in a way to get a free harpoon gun. It's the only flaw with the map, is you have to spin the box over and over to get the harpoon gun. It really hurts. You have another way to avoid RNG through the keypad. I love the keypad. I think that's brilliant. If there's just some way to get a harpoon gun without having to waste time in what was a flawless... That was a flawless Easter egg run. And just have it go completely off the freaking rails because I, I, RNG cucked me and I couldn't get a harpoon gun. That's very upsetting to me. That would have been amazing. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and comment. Try to think and remember... Stay gamer.